Uno, dos, tres. Uno, dos, tres, probando micrófono. Good afternoon. Hello, Carlita. Hello, teacher. How are you today? I'm fine. That's good. <laughs> Okay, good afternoon, Ernesto and Carlita. Welcome to your English class number, uh, I think it's number nine, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> Let me share with you the class, yes, this is class number nine, the class presentation for today. It's this. Okay, and the topic of class number nine is clothes and colors. So we're gonna learn about that. And today is Tuesday, March 8, 2022. So let me show you the lesson objectives we have for today's class. I would like, Carlita, can you read please the lesson number one, lesson objective one, and maybe Ernesto, can you please read the lesson objective number two? Okay, Carlita, you start with the lesson one, objective one. Okay. If in the class you will learn clothes, vocabulary, but particularly clothes which do we are for wall and for leisure. 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 Yes, thank you, Carlita. And Ernesto? In this class, you will learn the colors and how this topic is used in daily life. Exactly. So we'll talk about our clothes and also about colors. Mm -hmm. And if we have time, we are also going to learn about possessive pronouns. So let's begin. I have a, um, I have a prepared some pictures and you have to tell me what color is the picture you see okay the object you see in the picture okay so for example if i ask you what color is an apple you can say an apple is red so that we i need 10 volunteers but we only have seven <laughs> so everybody's going to participate we are going to start with jose con, with jose rivas then samuel then roxana henry miguel um Karen Villegas, and also Catherine, Roxana Diaz, Carlita Serrano. Okay, so let's start. What color is, oops, ay, se me salieron todos juntos. What color is a banana? Yellow. A ban okay, Joseph Rivas, uh -huh. in order. A banana 
is yellow. Excellent. Okay. Who is number two? Yeah, I don't remember. <laughs> I think it was Samuel. What color is a tomato? Yes. A tomato is red. Excellent. Okay, next person. What color is a sunflower? A sunflower. Person number three. I think it was Miguel. Miguel Ventura. What color is a sunflower? A sunflower is yellow. Excellent. Okay. Uh, next person, Catherine. What color is a leaf? A leaf is green. Green. Very nice. Okay. Roxana Diaz. What color is a cloud? A cloud. What color is a cloud? Uh, a cloud is... No sé qué color. <laughs> um, we can white? say it's white. white. Yes, white? a cloud is white. Thank you so much. Mr. Rojas, Henry. What color is wood? Wood. And wood is coffee. It's brown. Okay. Yeah. The color, el color café is brown. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, let me see. The other person I think it was Karen Villegas. What color is a bunch of grapes? A bunch of grapes. A bunch of grapes uh, is purple. Excellent. Okay. Um, let me ask. Let me see. Mirna. Mirna Revalo. What color is the snow? What color is the snow? What color is the snow? Permítame. Or another person can help me now. The snow is... No. Is white. It's white, exactly. And the ocean, what color is the ocean? Blue. It's blue. And the ocean is blue. What color is a tangerine? Orange. Yeah, a tangerine is orange. Yes. <laughs> Excellent. So I can see that you know the colors, guys. Good job. You know the colors. Good. So um, here we have more colors and tones. For example, uh, you can repeat after me with your micro with your microphone off. White, dark gray, brown, light gray, or gris claro, right? beige, dark brown, gray light brown, black. And we have the different colors here, red, pink, orange, yellow, light green, green, dark green, light blue, blue, dark blue, and purple. Nice. So if I ask you, what are your favorite colors? 
Look at this question. It's in plural. The question is in plural. What are your favorite colors? Okay, my favorite colors are pink, red, and green. Mm -hmm. So tell me, what are your favorite colors? My favorite colors is blue, red, and green. Okay, thank you, Catherine. Remember that if it's only one color, use, use the singular is. My favorite color is. But if it's plural, more than two, two and more, more than one, two or more, you use are. My favorite colors are. Okay? So, <clears throat> uh, Catherine, can you repeat, please? What are your favorite colors, Catherine? My favorite colors are blue red and green blue red and green oh yes i love those colors too <laughs> i like blue too so good good taste you have yeah good lights <laughs> um my favorite yeah. color are the green red and dark okay mr rojas likes green and red okay okay mr sanchez What's your, what are your favorite colors? My favorite, my favorite color is yellow. Yellow, wow, interesting. Yes. Okay, Siamara, what's your favorite color? Uh, my favorite colors are blue, purple, and black. Oh, you like purple, okay, yeah. nice. Um, let's see, somebody else. Carlita Serrano, what are your favorite colors? My favorite color is green. Your favorite color is green. Yes, that's my mom's favorite color too. She loves green, but she doesn't like yellow. <laughs> okay, very nice. So I can see that you can use uh, the colors correctly. Uh -huh. And to say uh, light, light, a light color is más claro, ¿verdad? And dark is más oscuro. So this is um, the formula or the structure. Remember when we talk about the color, all the, the colors are adjectives. Los colores son adjetivos. Así que vamos a seguir ese mismo the structure, the subject, the verb to be, and the color. The verb to be depends on the subject. Remember that. For example, the subject, my eyes, the verb to be, are, and the color. My eyes are black. Another example, your hair is dark red. Your hair. Um, their car is light gray. Uh, her dress is white her dress is white the wall the wall is dark green the wall is dark green and i um i put the sentences in those colors black dark red light gray white and dark green Okay, can you give me more examples using the chat? Can you give me examples, please? Subject, verb, and color. Subject, verb, and color, please. Examples, you can tell me about your hair, your eyes, your clothes, your gadgets, like cell phone, computer, your car, your house, etc. Uh, fruits. Please use the chat, okay, Jose Rivas? His card is blue, my pen is black. My bottle of water is pink. My mouse is pink. And I also have a lamp, which is pink. I don't know if you can see my, my lamp. Yeah, I have a lamp and it's pink, it's a pink. <laughs> 
my house are green and white. Okay, in that case, Ernesto is my, my house is, because house is singular, my house is green and white. My t-shirt is white, okay. My car is gray, my cap is black. Good job, my cell phone is white. My notebook is black. My shoes are black. My sandals are beige. My house is green, my hair is black, my pen is sky blue. Okay, very good, excellent. Examples, we have more examples. My cell, my cell phone is red. Okay, interesting. Very nice. So now let's learn about close vocabulary. You can see here different things like cap, sunglasses, remember sunglasses are the dark glasses that you use when you go to the beach. Okay, they are different from the glasses you wear when you read or when you work. We have a scar when it's cold. You protect your neck with a scar. Oh, the favorite, the popular jeans. Gloves, we don't, we don't use gloves so much in El Salvador, but you need to know the, the vocabulary. <laughs> Scared. Okay, the belt, um, the hat, okay, for woman or for men, uh, shoes in general, los zapatos deportivos se puede decir sport shoes or sneakers, a shirt, una camisa, dress, shorts, Los chores, en, en, es, viene de la palabra inglesa, vea, shorts. Trousers, también son pantalones, ¿verdad? Trousers, socks, t-shirt, ajá, socks, t-shirt, t-shirt, no t-shirt, 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 yes, and we have boots, boots. But um, yes, Joel. <laughs> okay, and we have more vocabulary here. A suit. We have a suit, which is pants and jacket, right? That's a suit. Un traje o saco. Blouse. Jeans. Blouse. Shoes. Shirt. Jacket. A tie. Do you wear a tie at work? Do you wear a tie at work? Yes. Yes? I, I work. No, I not. No, you don't. Okay. Then we have a coat. Guess who? Mm. All right. I forgot the word in Spanish, but this is a coat, right? Uh, the, the sweatshirt. La sudadera. Sweatshirt. Scar, socks, hat, boots, trainers, shorts, gloves, mittens. They are even hatter, the winter hat, pants or trousers, sweater, t-shirt, skirt. And for the shoes, girls, do you know how to say tacones in English? Do you know? How do you say tacones? It's high heels. Mm -hmm. High heels or high heel shoes or high heel sandals. ¿Cómo se dice sandalias de plataforma? Platform shoes. Or, or platform sandals. How do you say deportivos? Sport shoes or sneakers. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo se dicen, eh, bueno, las zapatillas? Flats. Flats. Las zapatillas que son planas, ¿verdad? Flats. We also have sandals. Sneakers. Sleepers son las, las, um, 
Las pantuflas, slippers. Las jeans que decimos nosotros, pero las jeans son flip-flops. 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 Mm -hmm. So you can copy in your notebook the new vocabulary, flats, sandals, slippers, flip-flops, sneakers, sports shoes. And we can also talk about accessories. Do you wear accessories? For example, these ones are called earrings, aritos, earrings. Also, we can have a necklace or a chain, cadena, chain, or collar, necklace, mm -hmm. chain or necklace, earrings. Or you can also talk about a ring, ring and bracelet, bracelet. And a watch, a watch. I don't have my watch today. <laughs> yeah, so those are different things. Now, guys, I will send you to groups, to rooms, and you are going to practice. What do you wear at work? What do you wear at home? What do you wear at the beach? A bikini. <laughs> what do you wear at a party? So um, in different situations, we wear different clothes different clothes for example at work uh you can say this is an example i wore at work i wear a uniform the uniform consists in a blue skirt a blue jacket high heel shoes and just that or i work i wear a polo shirt and jeans and sneakers or flats and etc. Okay, at home I wear shorts, I wear a t shirt, I wear a top, I wear flip flops, if your sandals, because you're at home, right? Or slippers. So uh, you are going to talk about it in your groups. I will send you the picture in WhatsApp so that you can have the information. So let's practice in the groups, please. Vaya, hay que apartamos dos dólares. Yeah. Yeah. At the party. Mm -hmm. What do you wear hat? Sweet. At the work. Correct. Mm -hmm. What do you wear at shoes? At at the world, at home, at the party. 
Yes. What do you wear at a scarf? Okay, I'm sorry. Just just an, a clarification. Okay. Hi, I understand the way you are doing it, and it's good. Where? Donde, eh? Where do you wear a dress, for example? Donde usas un vestido? Where do you wear a dress? Oh, you wear right. a dress in a party. But the question is, what, what do you wear at home? ¿Qué usas en casa? What do you wear at work? ¿Qué usas oh. en trabajo? What do you wear at the beach? Oh, I wear a bikini. Okay? And some glasses and a hat. Okay, so those are the... Okay. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. You can continue. Thank you. You're welcome. Vamos a ver, ahora. What do you... What do you wear at... At... At work? Catherine. Repeat, please. What do you wear at... A wall. A wall. Yes. A wall uniform that consists a t shirt, green, and jeans. Hello. No. ¿Cómo lo escucharon? No. Un poquito. A little. No. How do you wear in a party? What? Um, what do you wear at a party? What do you wear? Okay. And how do you wear? No, it's not correct. No. What do you wear? ¿Qué, qué usas? What do you wear? What do you wear? Si quieres preguntar, what do you wear? Si quieres preguntar at... cómo te vistes para una fiesta, and how do you dress? How do you dress? How do you dress? Ah, okay. How do you dress? Uh -huh. In this case, it's what do you wear? ¿Qué te pones? ¿Qué usas? What do you wear at work? Okay, okay. perfect. Samuel, what do you wear in the park? In the park, it's a uh, Jeans, it's a trainer, it's a t shirt. Okay, I wear, I wear a t shirt, I wear pants, I wear, okay. I wear, I wear, I wear, I wear jeans, I wear t shirts, I wear hat, I wear trainer. Estamos en la presentación de la chesta, la pregunta. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. What are you wearing? Ah, favorite color? <laughs> It's a. Uh, uh, la siguiente. La siguiente. Uh -huh. Vamos a ver. Esas, esas, esas. What do you wear? Pero ya regresaron todos, así es que. Ah, <laughs> Okay, I need volunteers to tell me what do you wear at work? What do you wear at work? Uh, I, uh, okay. At work, I wear um, pants or trainers or blouse, t-shirt. Uh, I trabajo de campo. <laughs> okay, nice. So you maybe you use a polisher or sometimes a blouse, sometimes a jean. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Sneakers or shoes. Very nice. Okay. What do you wear at home? Hello. 
Any volunteer? What do you mean? At home. The home and dress and jeans. Yes. Okay, at home I want a dress or jeans and t-shirts. Flip-flops. Ah, chancletas, yeah, flip-flops. <laughs> they are very comfortable. <laughs> okay, what do you wear at the beach? When you go to the beach, what do you wear? You wear a bikini or a swimsuit or shorts? At the, at the beach, a hat. A hat, okay. Um, the boys cap. wear a cap. A cap, glasses, shorts, sunglasses. Sunglasses, yes. Okay. And what do you wear at a party? At a party. Oh. A dress. A suit. A suit. A suit, un traje, a suit. A dress. Shoes or dress, shoes. Trainers. Shoes. Really? Trainer, trainers. It depends on the it depends on the way on the on the party, right? It depends on the on the party. <laughs> okay. Good job. Excellent. Very nice. So now, guys, let's go over the next activity. It's a conversation. The, the name of the conversation is It's a Disaster. Okay. Let's listen, please, to the pronunciation because later you will practice the conversation with your classmates. Okay. So Pat and Yuli. Pat says, great. Our clothes are dry. Where is my new blouse? Yeah, our, our clothes are dry. What color is it? It's white. Here's a light blue blouse. Is it yours? No, it's not mine. Wait, it is mine. It's a disaster. Oh no, all our clothes are light blue. Here's the problem. It's these new blue jeans. Whose jeans are they? Oh, they are mine, sorry. <laughs> Okay, so does that happen to you? Does that happen? Yeah, sometimes. With a black uh, dresses or pants. Wow, <laughs> oh, and then all the all the um, rest of the clothes are the same yes. color. <laughs> yes. Okay, so now guys, again, you will go to break of rooms and you will practice the conversation with your partners, okay? Okay. I will send you the conversation in a moment. It is mine. It's a disaster. Oh no, all our clothes are light blue. Here's the problem. Is there new blue jeans? Whose jeans are they? Oh, they are mine. Sorry. It's a desert. Oh no, all our clothes are light blue. Here's. The problem is the new blues, blue jeans. Whose jeans are they? Oh, they're my sorry. Okay, vamos al revés. 
Oh, never mind. Sorry. Uh, ahora yo soy Pat y tú eres Julie, ¿ok? Great. All clothes are dry. What is my new blues? It's white. A light blue. ¿Qué parece? Vaya, está bien. Está bien, Daniela. Great. Ajá, sí, ahora la vuelta para que los dos sí, este, sí. pronunciemos. Mm -hmm. Ok. Great. Our clothes are dry. We are is new blues. Clothes. So. What color it is? It is white. Here is a light blue blouse. Is it, is, it is yours? No, no, it's not my white. It is my, is a, a disaster. Disaster. Oh no, all your clothes are like blue. Where the problem is this now blue jeans. Most jeans are they? Oh, they are mine. So. Si gusta, ahora comienzo yo y luego usted. Sí, comienza usted. <laughs> okay. Great. Her clothes are dry. Where is my new boots? What color is it? Is it? Where's a uh, light blue, 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 blues? Is it yours? No, it's not mine. Wait a minute. Wait, no, wait. It's mine. It's a disaster. Oh, no. I'll, I'll. Clothes, clothes are like blue. Here is the problem. Is these new blue jeans? Whose jeans are they? Oh, oh they're my sorry. Oh, they must. So. Okay. Okay. Good job. Nice. Thank you. Very nice. Now I would like to have a couple of volunteers to practice the conversation in front of the class to role play the conversation. Two participants, okay. One is Xiomara and the other person is? <clears throat> Ernesto Alas, okay, Ernesto. And Patricia. Lights, camera, action. Okay, great. Our clothes are dry. What is my new blouse? What color is it? It's white. Here is a light blue blouse. It is yours? No, it's not mine. Wait. It is mine. It's a disaster. Oh, no. Oh, light blue. Here's the problem. Is there new blue jeans? Whose jeans are they? Uh, they are mine. Sorry. Okay. Good job, guys. Very nice. Thank you. Okay, so um, now I have this question. What are you wearing today? What are you wearing today? ¿Qué estás usando hoy? ¿Qué llevas puesto hoy? What are you wearing today? Well, in my case, today I am wearing an orange dress, as you can see. I am wearing a beige top inside my dress. 
in a pair of sandals that you cannot see, but I'm wearing sandals. I'm wearing a pair of earrings, my wedding rings, and that's it. What about you? What are you wearing today, please? Type in the chat, type in the chat. What are you wearing today? Y vamos a usar la, la estructura I am wearing. Y luego ponen the piece of clothes. Okay, Ernesto. I will go for a couple of, of water, guys. A glass of water, I need it. Okay, I'll be right back. Continue, please. Typing in the chat. Teacher, Miss, yes, mi camisa es color ocre, no sé cómo se dice ese color. Dark red. Ah, gracias. Okay. The jeans, blue jeans. Siempre le ponemos el color, cuando es así, ponemos el color antes de la ropa. Acuérdense que el color es como adjetivo, ¿verdad? I am wearing black shoes or a pair of black shoes. I am wearing a t-shirt, I'm wearing a gray sweater. I'm wearing decorated red blouse, black pants and black high heels, wow. I'm wearing a black pants. I'm wearing a pair. Vaya, miren, esta es otra cosa. ¿Se recuerdan que les hablamos de las que venían en parejas? Entonces eh, decimos, I'm wearing black pants. Or I'm wearing blue jeans. O decimos, a pair of. A pair of black jeans, por ejemplo. Blue jeans and blouse. I'm wearing a watch. Okay. Good. Okay, Karen says, I am wearing a black and white blouse. 
black pants and wearing flats. <laughs> Good. I'm wearing my glasses. Good. Very nice, guys. Very nice. Okay. So next, next topic, we have possessive pronouns. Let's learn about possessive pronouns. We have the possessive adjectives, my, your, his, her, our, and their. But the possessive pronouns are a little bit different. We have mine, yours, his, hers, ours, and theirs. But with possessive adjectives, we say, these are my socks, these are my shoes, these are her hair pants. But with the possessive pronouns, we say, these socks are hers. <laughs> Estos calcetines son de ella. These shoes are mine. Estos zapatos son míos. Uh, this watch is yours. Este reloj es tuyo. And so on. Vamos a ver aquí una forma más fácil. A possessive pronoun is a pronoun that is used to indicate possession or ownership. It's to indicate that something is ours, para indicar que algo es nuestro. Exa example, this pen is my pen, not your pen. Entonces, en vez de decir este lapicero, es mi lapicero, no tu lapicero, we can say, this pen is mine, este lapicero es mío, no tuyo. This pen is mine, not yours. Mine. This is my laptop. It's mine. Para decir es mío. Uh -huh. Entonces, en la tablita anterior, aquí quiere decir mío, tuyo, suyo, de él, ¿verdad? Suyo, de ella, nuestros y de ellos. Vamos a ver más ejemplos aquí en, este, en el siguiente. Ustedes pueden copiar. Possessive pronouns. Tenemos el sujeto, el subject pronouns, and the possessive. I, mine. You, yours. He, she, is. She, hers. It, is. And they, theirs. I want the blue shirt back. It's mine. Quiero mi camisa azul de regreso porque es mía. Es mía. It's mine. Okay. Next. Y aquí tenemos más ejemplos. I, my, and mine. Por ejemplo, that is my apple. The apple is mine. These are your flowers. Estas son tus flores. The flowers are yours. Son tuyas. Las flores son tuyas. He, his. Jacques is his dog. The dog is his. El perro es de él. She and her and hers. Ponemos una S. That box is her, is her present. Esa caja es su regalo. The present is hers. El regalo es de ella. It and its. The cat is sitting on its tree house. El gato está sentado en su casa de árbol. ¿Verdad? It's not common as possessive pronoun. Okay, it's. We are and ours. This is our house. The house is ours. They, their, and theirs. That is their house. The house is theirs. Esa es su casa. La casa es de ellos. And let's look at this. Um, exercises and tell me what is the correct, what is the correct form, okay? I have a sister. My. Her. Her name, by aquí, but in algunos casos vamos a poner un possessive adjective or un possessive pronoun. Her. This is Jack's book. But in el, in el primer caso, I have a sister, her name is Anya. Tengo una hermana, su nombre el de ella es Anna. This is Jack's book. The book is? His. exactly. Anyway, I have a sister. This jacket is? Her. Hers. Hers. Ah, hers. Hers. Tengo una hermana y esta chaqueta es de ella. It's hers. 
My Her. parents have a dog. Hers. My parents have a dog. He's it. It. It's. It. It's. 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 name is Spider-Man. <laughs> okay, this is. This is our book. Don't Good. touch it. Oh, this is my book. Don't touch it. <laughs> we like our house. It's. Me, nos, a nosotros nos gusta nuestra casa. We like our house. It's. Es de. Ours. 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 They have a. Ours. They have a blue car. The car is? Mine. They have a blue car. No, we. We. No, they. It's theirs. theirs. Exactly. The car is theirs. El carro es de ellos. The car is theirs. I like. They did a good job. I like. My job. My. It's there. Okay. I like their child. They did. Porque está hablando de ellos. They did a good job. Me gustó okay. el show de ellos. Hicieron un buen trabajo. I like their show. They did a good job. Is this new house? We bought it last week. They're, they're oh. new Oh. Our is this our oh, new house? Is this our new house? We bought it last week. La compramos la semana pasada. Don't touch this book. It's mine. It is mine. It's mine. Mine. Mm -hmm. mine. Very nice. I will send you guys some exercises that you can do. Okay. Um. Well, we're going to do one exercise. We're going to do it together. Okay? okay. We're going to do this exercise together. Possessive adjectives versus possessive pronouns. Ah, oh, well, it's, it's the same that we have just done. El que acabamos de hacer ahí. Sorry. But I will, I will send you the link for the other one. So that you can do it. Just give me a moment to send you the I will send you via WhatsApp and also via Zoom. Okay. Choose the right possessive pronoun. For example, I have a new book. It is. Mine. It's mine. Sí, ahorita les mando las otras diapositivas, ¿ok? Bueno, hagan el ejercicio, por favor. Do the exercise, please. <laughs> Yo tengo un nuevo libro, it's mine. Mine. Ella tiene un nuevo gato. Here's. They have a new tower. It is tower, tower. They 
Ellos. Did they they we have new shows. There are ¿Cómo sienten el ejercicio? Easy, difficult, or so so. So so. Así es este, este, este tema de los possessive pronouns. But once yes. you understand, it's easy. Ya en media vez le agarren, ya no les va a costar. Es una, nada más cuestión de lógica. Okay. Bueno, vamos a hacerlo juntos entonces. I have a new book. It is. My. It is mine, es mío. She has a new card. It is? Hers. Hers. They have new towels. It is? Theirs. Theirs. De ellos, ¿verdad? We have new shoes. They are? Ours. Ours. He has a new car. It is? This. You have a new toy. It is? Yeah. Yours. Lucky. The dog has a new bone. It is? It is. It is. The book belongs to Anna. It is? Hers. Hers. This is my coat. It is? Mine. It is mine. The chair belongs to Mary. It is? Hers. Hers. Es de ella. And that's it. We say finished. Check my answers. And yes, we got 10, guys. <laughs> okay, hope you can do the exercise. Okay, so we have three minutes to do the wrap up and you can tell me what you learned. Oh, excellent. I'm receiving your result. And that is great. Very nice. Okay, so can you tell me what we learned in this class? And maybe you can give, for example, about the colors. Can you give me example sentences with the colors, with the clothes, or with the possessive pronouns? Okay, Jose Rivas, yo lo veo con ganas de participar. I'm really willing to participate. <laughs> and after you, Henry. Okay, what is the... The, the question. Uh -huh, the question. Uh, just give me an example of what you learned in this class. Deme un ejemplo de lo que aprendí. Okay. In this class, I learned about the what's wearing today. What are you wearing today? Okay, so tell me, what are you wearing today, Jose Rivas? I am wearing a blue t-shirt, a blue shirt, and I, I am wearing a black pants. Black pants and blue shirt. Yes. Are you wearing a belt? Yes, I'm wearing a belt. Are you wearing socks? No, socks, no. No, sin calcetines, anda. Oh. 
<laughs> Are you wearing socks? <laughs> yes, yes, I wear it. <laughs> okay, very nice. Thank you, Jose Rivas. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. <laughs> Henry Rojas, you wanted to participate. Tell me, what did you learn in this class? In this class, I learned about the different colors and the, the possessive adjective. Uh, and and the different clothes and different clothes okay thank you so much can you describe the color of your of your clothes uh, and i uh, and my teacher is brown okay and jeans is blue okay. and the shoes is black okay so my and shoes cap, are and cap the red Okay, my cap is red, my shoes are black, my jeans are blue, okay? Remember, pants, socks, jeans, shorts, shoes, sandals, earrings, in pairs. Como van en pareja, son plurales, ¿verdad? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, very nice. Irma Suleima Grande, please tell us what you learn in this class. I learned in this class is um, um, different clothes, um, wearing clothes, um, uh, and the colors. Uh, and the colors, um, and pronouns. And the possessive pronouns, exactly. Okay, uh, what are the possessive pronouns? Mind. Mind. Are you? Yours. You, he, her. Hers. It's. It's. Uh, the, the, ours. 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 And theirs. And theirs. Excellent. Okay, class, it was a pleasure to see you today. I hope to see you tomorrow. Um, the only homework I will ask you is to please continue working in the platform. That's going to be the homework, okay? <laughs> so it's very important that you advance as much as you can in the platform and review your classes, review the classes. Okay, guys, um, see you tomorrow and have a nice afternoon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, teacher. Bye.